Get ready to be blown away by some incredible news straight from the Hollywood. It seems like a ray of sunshine has finally pierced through the clouds of a sluggish summer at the box office, thanks of two blockbuster films that have taken the world by storm. You just won't believe the jaw-dropping numbers these movies have brought in during their opening weekend in North America. I want drumroll please, Greta Gerwig's directorial masterpiece. Barbie hit it with a whopping $155 million in ticket sales. That's right, it even outshone the Super Mario Bros. Movie to become the biggest opening of 2023. But that's not all, hold on to your seats. Christopher Nolan's Oppenheimer, the creeping biographical drama chronicling the life of J. Robert Oppenheimer, pulled in a cool $80.5 million, exceeding the expectations with one of the strongest debut in this genre. And here's the icing on the cake. Fans on social media have coined the term Barbie and Heimer to describe this epic event, where both films were released on the same day. I mean, who would not want to catch these highly anticipated blockbusters together in an incredible double feature? Barbie and Heimer is quickly becoming a legend projected to rank in over $300 million by the end of the weekend, securing its place as the fourth biggest box office opening of all the time. But it's not just the numbers that have everyone buzzing. Critics are raving about both movies, with Barbie scoring an impressive 90% and Oppenheimer soaring to 94% on Rotten Tomatoes. Talk about a winning competition. What makes the success story even sweeter is the fact that Hollywood has been grappling with its biggest strike in decades. And the past months have not exactly been red hot at the box office. But Barbie and Heimer has come to the rescue. Reviving the industry with a much needed boost. So what else made the box office top 5? Well, there was Sound of Freedom, a controversial action thriller stirring up some debate, coming in at the number 3 spot with $20.14 million, then Paramount's Mission Impossible, Dead Reckoning Part 1, and Indiana Jones and the Doll of Destiny claimed the 4th and 5th spots, bringing in $19.5 million and $6.7 million respectively. Viewers, it's safe to say that this weekend was nothing short of a historic first cinema. Michael O'Leary, the CEO of National Association of Theatre Honors, could not contain his excitement, calling it a phenomenal experience for people who love movies on the big screens. And you know what? I could not agree more. There's something magical about watching these blockbuster in the theatre. Surrounding by fellow movie lovers, cheering, gasping, and laughing together. It's a celebration of the silver screen that we all missed so much. So, if you have not already made sure to catch Barbie and Oppenheimer on the big screen, while the hype is still going strong, trust me, it's an experience you won't want to miss. And that's a wrap for this incredible box office weekend update. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to stay in the loop with all the things movies. Until next time, keep watching and I'll catch you in the next video.